At Langley Research Center, we believe that technologies are not just hardware and software. It also includes the people and facilities that makes those technologies happen. As we've been developing our systems, we've been talking to people in industry and academia about the kinds of needs that they would have in a science platform. The eBeam technology offers them a tool that can build other tools and things that then the astronauts can use in, in pursuit of exploration. The ultimate goal is to develop an onboard system that can recognize failures and damage and automatically reconfigure the controls so that the aircraft can be landed safely. Here in the flight research hangar at NASA Langley, we have six research aircraft. We support aeronautics research, science research, and we're beginning to work now with space operations folks. And what we're looking at is the dynamic stability of the vehicle after uh, or during an abort test. The spin tunnel is a perfect place to do that. The key item is to be able to engage and disengage the experimental flight controller while the plane's flying around. Takeoff is fully autonomous. What we've done is interfaced with the vendor already at this point so that we know how to target the properties that are needed for this material. Rather than developing an aircraft that meets some aeronautical requirement, um, we optimize the instrument and the aircraft at the same time. That's really the beauty of this, is you end up with an optimized sensor vehicle. We have a framework that hasn't been done before of doing measurements where the sensors themselves are electrically open circuits with no electrical connection. Here in systems analysis, we really help decision makers make more informed decisions. We work on everything from the runway all the way to the stars. We are your technology gateway. Make Langley the place to find answers to your technology challenges.